So the album comes out. I mean, look, you you get to this space of amazing clarity. Holy shit, you dropped this album, life-changing album. After going through the meditation process, the first proof of concept is the product that was developed during or while or after. So the yeah. light bulb now that goes off is what? Nah, I, I just, I, my take was, this is what it feels like when you, when you are, are really in tune with yourself, really mm. in tune with God, when, you're, when, when the noise can't enter. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. This is what it feels like. And even to this day, bro, it's like, it's, it's, like, it's funny because I, I, I find myself talking about meditation a lot, but it's not like, but it's only because in conversation, I, I meet people and they're telling me about like things that I went through. And I'm mm -hmm. just telling them, oh, this is what I did. Mm -hmm. But the, the, the interesting thing is, it's like, it got me to a, to a place where my lowest point is so much higher than what my what my lowest point used to be. Mm. But mm. I will say, I'm not a person that, that currently to this day just wakes up and meditates every day. I think about Rick, like Rick Rubin. When I watch these Rick Rubin interviews and he just feels like a, just a sensei master and they just, I just imagine him waking up every day and just meditating three times a day. And maybe he doesn't, <laughs> yeah. but it's my impression of him. Yeah, yeah. And I realize that like, oh man, people probably have that impression about me yeah. because I've spoken about it. They probably think I'm on some like, but the truth is no, it's like I, I, I use meditation now as like, I, I say it as like an emergency break glass thing, where it's like, if I'm feeling high anxiety, you know what I mean, for whatever's happening in my life, which is not often right now, but but if something's coming up where it's like, whew, I'm feeling anxiety about this, like this is, then I'll use it as like, let me get back to a balanced state. But I'm not currently in a space where it's like, I'm meditating every day, boom, boom, boom. Nah, I feel like that year or two year stretch that I was on it, it gave me a nice, like, like, boost in my life to where it's like now I'm kind of coasting. And I do though believe that even in this state right now that I'm in, if I meditated every day, like I feel like I'd be a superhero, you know yeah. what I mean? Because I feel like everything would just whew, whew, yeah, off me yeah, like water. It, it, it's repelling. It's yes, repelling bro. Off, right? yes. When you say anxiety, do you feel like, is the anxiety from the business? Is the anxiety from the pressure that you sometimes put on yourself? Mm. Is the anxiety from household, family, yeah, that, wife? Like, like where's, for, where's for the instance, from? Like, like when I said like emergency break glass situation, mm. Like there was a time when my my first child was gonna be born, and and the anxiety I felt was more like it wasn't like oh I'm about to have a kid, but it was probably the culmination of all these things. But I was also uh, finishing an album at that mm -hmm. time. Mm -hmm. We was doing the classes, mm -hmm. trying to learn about like like the birthing process mm -hmm. and all of this. Boom, boom, boom. So it was like it was one of those moments where everything was kind of like a lot was happening, mm -hmm. and 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 that was like a moment where I just needed to, you know, before uh, one of the classes that we had, which I love those classes that we took, it's called Hypno Babies. I recommend that for anybody that's, that's you hypno? know. Hypno? Hypno Babies, wow. basically. Okay. It's like a, a birthing class that, that uh, you know, first of all, I think the first most important thing it does is it prepares both uh, parents for the realities or like like the information that you might need to arm yourself when you go into a hospital. That's <laughs> why my babies came out. It's, it's a shit show around here. Well, it, said, it had me feeling prepared. Yeah, like I, was, I was in there. Yeah, I, I just said I'll figure it out. Um, baby came out. A lot of shit happened fast too. It worked though, right? I was at the doctor all the time. The baby coughing, doc. What's happening? It's just a cough. All right. We'll no, 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 no. It's not that though. Not no, that. No, I'll tell you what it was for me. Okay, all right, man. <laughs> I was I was that guy. Nah, me too though, by okay. the way. I was, this is just when, scared me. the birthing process. Okay. After the baby's out, they don't they don't got nothing for you. Okay. This was like they have nothing okay, to offer you after going, the fact. Going through the the course of the nine months and you know when you when, when that water breaks, mm. this is what you need to look at. Were out you there when the water broke? Yeah. I was downstairs. <laughs> oh, I mean, yeah, 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 for sure, for sure. No, 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 I didn't see it like a movie, by the okay, way. Okay, I was about to say, was nah, right nah, there, nah, like, it wasn't no movie like, moment. Bro, oh, shit. Nah, 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 nah. Got nah, you. Nah. No, nah. like, it was no. uneventful. It's not like the movie. Like, you know, in the movies, they make you feel like it's like a, like a, like some sort of like, Yeah, do you got to I get the car. <laughs> yeah, yeah, nah, it wasn't like that. I get the car. Nah. You got the bag? For it's sure. already packed by oh the my door. God. Yeah, yeah, no, no none doubt. of that shit happened. None of that. I was really downstairs. Babe, my water broke. Huh? Huh? Yeah, that's where I was.